Good afternoon, girls. It's Monday, and yes, I just watched a Vlogbrother video, so that's why I'm talking like this. I have some questions to answer, and I'm going to go ahead and answer everybody's questions, because why not? Uh, music that I'm currently into was the question that was asked by Tara. Um, I've been kind of regressing back to music that I used to listen to when I was a lot younger, like music I would listen to in college and high school. I've been listening to The Beatles, The Who, like avidly, randomly deciding to just listen to their whole albums all the time. Um, I've been listening to the Crazy Heart soundtrack. Pretty much like every other day I decide to just go ahead and listen to the Crazy Heart soundtrack again. Um, I already said the Beatles. Uh, I've been listening to a lot of playlists. I've been making, going crazy making playlists on iTunes. I make playlists for characters that I've created. Um, I make playlists for moods. So like if I'm feeling happy, I want to listen to a lot of ukulele music, so I have a ukulele playlist. Um, and I have playlists that are things like all of the Flight of the Concord songs that I have, and it's a lot, and things like that. I just like to keep things organized. Um, I have a Rhett and Link playlist that's pretty much most of my iTunes, too. Um, but yeah, I have things like Metric on there, and I can't stop listening to the song by Metric that Tara gave me. Um, and I have the um, Edward Sharp and the Magnetic Zeros singing Home, which is probably one of the happiest songs I've ever heard, and if you haven't heard it yet, you should check it out. I guess I can annotate to it. The music video is really sweet, too. But yeah, it's probably one of the happiest things I've ever heard, and I can't not be happy when I listen to it. Uh, Anne Horse. I've been listening to several different songs by Anne Horse. They're really awesome. Um, and The Mountain Goats, who John Green loves, and it's because of John Green that I've started listening to The Mountain Goats, but I have a Mountain Goats playlist, too, that's an album and a few other songs that I like by them, and I just listen to that on a loop a lot. So yeah, that answers that question. <laughs> I've been into a lot of music lately. Um, and crunchy or cre creamy peanut butter, creanut butter, was asked by Tally, um, which is an awesome question, by the way, because I love peanut butter. Like, I'm not even too picky about it, it as I just really like it, but if I have to choose, I guess I would say crunchy, just because that's the kind that I usually put on my sandwiches. It's <laughs> spreading, I guess. But yeah, I, I toast my bread like itself too, but I like the crunchiness. I don't know why. I don't put too much on it. That probably helps, but seriously. Yeah, I prefer crunchy to creamy. Um, favorite season is autumn, and I've talked about this before, I think. My favorite holiday is Halloween too, and I just, I really like um, autumn because the temperature is not too cold and it's not hot, and the leaves are beautiful. And I just feel like the colors outside, the oranges and the light browns and the, the green that's not like bam green, I just, I really like it. I like spring too. My birthday's in spring, but, and spring is warmer. It's freezing right now. I think my least favorite season would have to be winter. I just really don't like being cold. Ah, so anyway, but yeah, I like autumn. And that's all the questions. So <laughs> I have a question and it kind of relates to something that happened last weekend and I should have asked it last Monday, but my brain was not in the right place because I was on my bed, so my brain was in a different place because it was somewhere different. Um, but my question is, are you into award shows? We're kind of in the doldrums right now between Golden Globes and Oscars, so are you at all interested in... it doesn't have to be them either. Are you interested in general in watching award shows? It could be the Grammys, the People's Choice Awards, which I don't particularly like, but yeah, do you ever get excited? I've had parties about the Oscars before, like Oscars parties. This year, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to uh, delay the Oscars. I'm not gonna completely miss it, but my parents and I, I say unfortunately like it's bad, but my parents and I are going to see Bon Jovi the same day as the Oscars, the same night as the Oscars, so what we're planning to do is go to the concert and then come home and watch the Oscars on TiVo. Hopefully that will work. So I'm going to be avoiding finding out who won, so that'll be interesting. It'll be like a delayed reaction, and then you'll probably see me tweeting about how excited I am for such and such a person, but yeah, so there's that. But <laughs> Bon Jovi is somebody that I like. I only know a few songs by them, but I do like them. And we're going to see U2, I think, in the summer, 
We're seeing a lot of concerts. It's pretty crazy. P -p pretty crazy. I'm, I'm cold, see? Um, but yeah, that's pretty much everything that I have to talk about so far. So, and I answered all the questions. So, uh, <laughs> and I'm glad that the Steelers won and are going to be in the Super Bowl. I was watching with my dad last night thinking I wasn't going to be interested, and I turned out to be interested, so there's that. I'm excited about the Super Bowl, too, and it's crazy. So anyway, Tara, I will see you tomorrow. I hope you're having a good day, girls, and yes, stay warm. <laughs>